The charming Cayman Islands continue to be a coveted Caribbean getaway for both adventurous and more immobile travelers. Gorgeous barrier reefs call to divers as the rum punch calls to the beach bums. Honeymooners hike through the 200-year-old Mastic Trail as parents take their children for interactive swims at Stingray City. Whichever way you choose to mellow out, the Cayman Islands can oblige. The Cayman Islands are an archipelago of three islands, lying 90 miles south of Cuba. The largest, Grand Cayman, is full of gargantuan resorts with all-inclusive options, perfect for those who prefer pre-planned itineraries and don't mind sharing the sights with cruise crowds. For freewheeling vacationers, the less-traveled Cayman Brac and Little Cayman offer some of the best diving in the Caribbean. Take note of the Cayman Islands dress code, swimsuits are okay on the beach or cruise ship, but you should dress more formally off the beach and in town. The official currency of the Cayman Islands is the Cayman Islands dollar, which is roughly equivalent to the U.S. dollar. Since the Cayman Islands dollar to U.S. dollar exchange rate can fluctuate, be sure to check what the current exchange rate is before you go. However, U.S. dollars are pretty readily accepted in the Cayman Islands, as are major credit cards. As for tipping, restaurants usually expect a 15% tip, though check the bill carefully because gratuity might already be added. Taxi cab drivers anticipate anywhere from a 10 to 15% tip. Note that the service charge at hotels is usually included and ranges from 6 to 12%. The best way to get around the Cayman Islands is by car. Rental agencies and taxis are plentiful at the Owen Roberts International Airport, GCM, on Grand Cayman. Rental cars and mopeds are also available on the smaller Cayman Brac and Little Cayman. Private boat operators can help you get to either of those islands from Grand Cayman. Cayman Brac and Little Cayman also have their own airports with daily flights operated by Cayman Airways.